As Western Oregon recovers from the devastating ice storm, experts want you to be prepared for another type of disaster, the big one. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Matt Templeman. And I'm Renee McCullough. It was 324 years ago today that the massive Cascadia earthquake devastated the Pacific Northwest. As KEZI 9 news reporter Jennifer Singh shows us, today is another reminder to be prepared for natural disasters, whether it's from the sky above or the ground below. Today marks the anniversary of the last Cascadia earthquake 324 years ago that rattled the Pacific Northwest at a magnitude of between 8 and 9. So this date is important for a, a multiplicity of reasons. One is we're certain that uh, it did occur. And two is it helps remind us to be prepared as a society for what's coming. And what's coming is an earthquake that could reach the same magnitude as the one hundreds of years ago or more. You know, it feels a little odd to be talking about preparedness so soon after such a severe winter storm. Uh, but that also underscores the importance of preparedness, not only at that individual level for every household, but also as we look at our systems for response and on ways that we can improve too. Not if, but when the next earthquake hits. I'm told the three most important things to have on hand are water, shelter, and food. I think as hard as this most recent storm was, and I know there are still people in our community absolutely feeling the immediate effects of that storm, once, once we're ready, we should take sort of a collective breath and think, what are the things I wish I would have had with me or in my home while I was without power, while I was not able to leave because the roads were not safe. And she tells me Lane County has resources for how to prepare for when the big one strikes. A really great one-stop shop is ready.gov and it breaks down the types of preparedness that individuals, families, older adults, businesses, children, um, and the steps and materials and things you can do to be as prepared as possible. In Eugene, Jennifer Singh, KEZI 9 News.